gonna present it. All right, Topher, come I'm on down. Oh, it's Isaac Rentz! Hi, I'm Isaac Rentz. Um, in in uh, directing this film, as Isaac Rentz, what I needed was a star. And I found one in the incomparable Topher Grace. Um, just, I can't say enough good things about him. Physically, and Adonis. Um, emotionally, there for me when I need him. And uh, just a, very charitable, too. Is Isaac here yet? Is anyone even looking for Isaac? Isaac Rentz is a brilliant uh, music video director, I and mean, we were so lucky to have him bring his uh, musical talent and his visual talent to this really funny, cool film. And we're really lucky that you guys are going to see it. Is, is that Isaac? No. And you guys are being way too quiet. Make some fucking noise! Okay, this is opening night. You know, I'm so sorry. I accidentally went in the wrong room and introduced a showing of Angry Birds. They <laughs> really loved you, man. You did really well. Uh, I heard Topher did a great job. He did. He was a better me. Well, yeah, a little. <laughs> Who would you like to bring down with you? You know, I feel really naked up here, so anybody from the cast you like coming down. Anybody. Great, Topher. Do you see me? Don't be shy, guys.
you get to pick the best moments of all that, and you get a mix of what you said. And you get something like Angry Birds, which is great. It's playing in theater for, you can still make it. The pigs are mad. Um, so the other side of it, obviously, was the music, which made me so happy. Like, every song in there, I was like, was that really a one-hit wonder? I feel like I know all of them. No, I just really know that one Patrick Swayze song. Um, and so I'm, I'm wondering, like, how, it's a unique thing to be casting for people who are both um, able to just emote and carry a scene because there's some actually really nice, genuine emotional beats, um, but then to have the comedy sort of throughout, but then to add singing and performing on top of that. Like it's a whole other layer of the casting and there's a whole other layer of what you're shooting. Like people don't do musicals for their first film a lot, probably for many of the reasons you might have run into in production. How was it? How was the music side? How did you get these people? I was the cheat code. <laughs> they were like, we need that dude to sing. So they were like, ah. And then I was like, ah. But I was like, ah. No, no, it's true. When we first met with JC. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think it was, just, it was his first thing in a, in a big in a, or a big role in a movie. And he kind of said, like, you know, I'm going to be leaning on you for acting support. And then the first thing we did was went into the studio, and we were really leaning on JC. He started like getting behind the board and like <laughs> mixing. And trust me, those were like me singing was like all my best takes <laughs> that I only did one time. He figured out how. To, so we were really in debt to JC. He was musically uh, really good. And just so you know, Topher wrote the song "Sex." It's a brilliant songwriter. I mean, it's a lot of fun to sing that song. It's bad on purpose. It is. By the way, it's that 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 play is like the smallest version away from being something on Broadway. Like, like don't they have Rock of Ages? Isn't that like just Rock of Ages, but just like here? It's like that could exist, and it should. And it would be a huge hit. And we should all just make a ton more money by just making that show. I'm telling people to see it. I'd love to hear from the ladies. Um, you guys had brought just different versions of Thunder. I loved the comedic elements. You both had great musical performances. Please talk, or I'm just like narrating an amazing love fest. Can you tell me about how it was working on this in Mexico? Uh, I actually was at the time doing Matilda on Broadway. So I did the show, I flew up to Mexico the next day and then was on a fake Broadway set. Sure. Um, it literally is the same, the same shit that goes down backstage in this movie is what happens on Broadway. So for me, it was just like every other day. Um, That's all I want to hear because my dream of most careers is that it involves dance-offs on a professional level. So. And it really does. <laughs> it really does. And I had known Tay before, and there uh, there have been some dance-offs before. Um, no, it, it, everything that happens in the movie actually happens on the Broadway. And you're working with young children, so look, they can start to the Matilda, there's a lot of talking of fucking. <laughs> Seven-year-old is like, yeah, I gave that person a hand job. You'd be shocked. <laughs> You'd be shocked. Work with Matilda. I use the sling and Matilda to give someone a blowjob. <laughs> no part of me expected to hear that sentence this evening, so I appreciate it. I wish I don't have no, no, even. He said sex swing. I don't know where, how you couldn't just gracefully jump off of that. Well, you, have, you, have you ever done Broadway? No, I haven't done Broadway, and now I'm a little afraid. <laughs> to be honest with you. Well, we do need to shove you all into the lobby to become best friends in some place that's not this theater. But Isaac, is there anything you would like to say Woo! to these people who came to the opening night of your opening night? You know, really quick, I just want to thank the whole cast. Let's give them a huge round of applause. They were amazing. Um, I, I feel so lucky. You know, my first time I have to work with an amazing cast, and there are people who do. 100 films and don't get to work with an amazing cast. So, really grateful for that. I'm um, really grateful to Dark Factory. Um, they were amazing Woo! collaborators on this. We couldn't have asked for better people to work with and collaborate with. Um, and 
just want to thank all of you guys tonight. It was really fun. I've watched this movie like 300 times now, and I still love it. And I still love hearing people react to it. So thanks so much. It was a real blast. Sure, but just we have another screening. And I love all of you. Bye.